Alex Bowman and Stuart Friesen die bomb leader Kyle Busch with two to go in the truck race, all making contact and allowing Zane Smith to pass and win. Spot on, spot off, Freddie. Uh, spot off on KB's part. I thought he made the mistake of, of just leaving the door wide open. You know, he took a big arc into that corner and just kind of invited them guys to take a shot at and him. And turned down. Uh, yeah, and then came down, you know, like they weren't there. Uh, how bad do you think Alex Bowman? I mean, at the end of that race, Bowman was better than Kyle, like towards, you know, before them. Little he was getting ready to pass him. You know, he was running him down. And when the yellow came out, I was like, oh, I think Bowman's got him. And I think that Alex Bowman would have loved nothing more in the world than to, than to go and beat yeah. Kyle Bush heads up in that truck race. I think he was going to. Yeah, as well. I think he was too. Um, the hack is back. The hack is back. Uh-huh. Um, but yeah, I mean, for one thing, this truck series, these green white checkers are just a recipe for disaster because it's ridiculous. these guys don't give, they don't care. They, they just don't race. Run, they don't race. They just run each other over. <laughs> I mean, it's it's, it's a joke like i don't understand like we talk about earlier you know you even look at the raw situation and you talk about when is an appropriate time for like nascar to step in and maybe penalize somebody i don't like i hate judgment calls and i don't want to put any more judgment calls so i'm fine with them not making calls on a situation like ross but when this series here where it's a feeder series and these kids need to learn my god do something because this is a joke like i don't think you can do anything days, man i don't know what you can do you but can't do anything let them yeah, wreck it's just like my goodness it's, it's it, a it mess. changes the integrity of the sport of auto racing when we allow bumper cars and these people to drive like idiots yeah, it does they lose their minds like they just literally lose their minds but it's because we let them yeah yeah well they're, that's they're on the parameters it's so hard to to and, and you know like you're trying to teach Derek how to race some in that in that group, but man, when you're in that group, you don't. There's, you're doing nothing but racing around people that have a lot of bad habits. And I, how do you, you know, when we follow someone out of the corner and she watches them knock somebody out of the way, well, that's how you're supposed to pass now. Like that's not right. No. Like Derek, Derek's been working with Josh Wise and Scott Speed. Part Derek's of gotten better Chevy program, and like his road racing the other yesterday was immensely improved from where yeah. it had been last year. And he's had a good, quiet yeah. year so far. And so I'm like, you know, <laughs> and but to hit to that point, and this is I don't know if this is what's going on around him or not, but it was whatever that race was. Was it 42 laps, something like that? He ran 38 laps like he listened to every word Josh Wise said. And then the last three laps, he looked like he yeah. never met Josh Wise. Like we're bouncing off people. People are bouncing off us. And I'm like, just get back to what you've been doing all day long. My yeah, God. it's hard, though, because as soon as somebody it's like the go kart race, man, we're on the last lap. Everything's all good. As soon as I hit you into that sh- that hairpin, what what are you gonna do when you get yeah. mad at me? Yeah, of course. I think it's awesome. You know, I I, I we we're just fussing. He almost about backed the, into one. We were just fussing about the the truck series and how these guys race. But at the end of the day, man, this is like uh, it's like Bowman Gray on NASCAR style. Like it's awesome. I I, I don't have a dog in the fight in the truck series, and um, to to have the veterans out there like Kyle and Alex, um. <laughs> And, and have them getting upset. I mean, Kyle, there's nothing better on television in NASCAR than to see Kyle Busch climb out of a car pissed <laughs> off. The look on his face is so transparent that he is so mad that he could spit fire. His <laughs> desire to win is probably higher than anybody else's out there. And there's no more of a piss poor loser than Kyle AJ Bush. had a little bit of it. Did you? Yeah. yeah. I don't know, Bob. I don't know, Bob. <laughs> nope. Did you see Bowman's interview? Yeah, I guess if I put it on a T-shirt, sell the hell out of it. Yeah, <laughs> yeah just uh, watching the footage of Kyle and Alex tr- or Alex trying to talk to Kyle, and Kyle like wouldn't even look at him. He's like, yeah, Kyle yeah. just did. <laughs> he's got that. Yep. He's got that water bottle with that yep. long ass straw. That's, that's when you know he's pissed off. He's just sitting there, uh, the water really? bottle with the straw in his mouth, just what, not what even looking. What do you think he's thinking? What do you think his PR person's thinking? Oh, <laughs> his poor PR talk. person talk. in Please general. Don't talk. Please don't talk. <laughs> Oh, I don't know, Bob. <laughs> yep. Yeah. Yep. AJ should have a shirt that just says, yep. And on the back says, I don't know, Bob. <laughs> <laughs>